remember to leave a like and subscribe. It helps others find the channel and I appreciate it. All right, hope you enjoyed the video. that you're not always in these conditions. You're not always out in daylight. You might want to be in uh, darker conditions, in which case a light on your life jacket, on your kayak or whatever it is, might be really important. This particular model is called an Arbilac. It's helpful in the sense that if you were to end up in the water, it's dark and you need to actually let rescuers find you. It has this kind of blinking emergency light, or you can just use it as a general light to make you more visible to other vessels on the water. In case of night paddling, in case of paddling in the dark, that is a situation where you might not always plan for kayaking after dark, but you could get delayed or stranded or for whatever reason actually ending up paddling later than you thought. And in that case, bringing proper lighting along can obviously be very, very important. So I already mentioned this that I keep on my life jacket, which provides some lighting and warning towards other vessels on the water. Uh, what I tend to use as well <coughs> is this, it's called a navy light. And there are obviously many different solutions, but this is something which can shine omnidirectional, have an emergency setting or a more economic setting. And this is something that I would fix to the kayak and make sure that I'm visible after dark towards other vessels. That's really critical. And obviously, in addition to that, uh, I might need to actually see where I'm going. Uh, usually in, in the dark, if it's not enormously dark and if there are not immediate obstacles in the water, I might use my own eyes actually to navigate. But in many cases, you're closer to shore, there might be rocks, etc., etc. Then I might use a headlight in order to light up the surroundings around me or after the paddling trip to actually be able to see all my gear as I'm packing up my kayak and all my gear. Again, with the color coding, I tend to have a small yellow dry bag for electronics, not just lighting, but also a power bank and charger cable for my phone or other gear. So that in case I run out of battery, I have extra resources for that. And waterproof.
Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe in order to help others find the information on this channel. Stay safe out there and happy paddles!